my past report, Dr. Razor has mentioned two incidents where he missed his medication for three days and uh, he apparently suffered a fairly rapid deterioration. Uh, these have been mentioned in Dr. Razor's report. One was when he missed his bed for three days and his mother noticed he had not been sleeping at all. He was becoming more psychotic and I think that then led to him uh, walking out with a can of gasoline to the church. And uh, there was another incident where he had missed about three or four days of meds and he became quite disturbed and distressed in his mental state. So I think in this case, it looks like it's, we're not talking of weeks or months. Thank you for answering my question. Thank you. Uh, Dr. Natarajan, yep. this uh, episode at the church, have you discussed with Mr. Jukic uh, what motivated him and whether that belief is still active in his presentation? Uh, I would have liked to. Unfortunately, I haven't got the opportunity because the only opportunity I had was on the 9th of September when we were unable to discuss that during the video call. You're talking to him. Uh, and I wasn't involved in his care prior to that, so uh, I'm afraid I haven't kept up with it. Okay. Uh, but from my understanding of both speaking to Dr. Kurbir Singh and reading through his discharge note, uh, he did have clear-cut delusional belief that there was uh, extremely evil activity, which he described as satanic activity, child abuse, pedophilia, which was happening at the church. I'm quite certain that these were delusional beliefs, as Dr. Singh has explained. And it was these delusional beliefs that led to him behaving in that manner towards the church. Okay. What were the circumstances that brought him to uh, the hospital in July? <laughs> What? Okay. Uh, Come here. Uh, be quiet, be quiet. You can talk later. Um, monitoring his family, 
um, so, so, so still very much believing that medication is and not wanting to take it uh, and, and wanting to come off it in the future. And Dr. Natarajan, as I understand it, you, your presentation, you, you say that the patient, even under treatment, still displays symptoms of his psychosis, which are quite uh, florid. Yes, he does. Uh, uh, yes, it is true. He does have psychotic symptoms. I do not believe they are as intense as what they were back in July, because if it was that intense, and he begins to act on those delusions, which is why he bought that gasoline and went to set the church ablaze. Uh, so, I, so I mean, the intensity of the psychotic symptoms is decreased by treatment. Uh, I don't think we've achieved a period of total stability where we've been able to make him symptom free. Uh, but yes, being under treatment does help in muting the symptoms. He's still psychotic, but I wouldn't say he's a risk to others at this point in time. And uh, does, it, does, it, does the applicant derive, does he recognize any benefit from the medications he's been prescribed? <clears throat> in my interaction with him on the 9th of September, which I have mentioned, I do not feel he has the necessary insight to understand that. He clearly states he does not need to be on meds and does not want to take meds, and there's no need for it. Okay. Thank you, Dr. Ranarajan. Those are my questions. Thank you. Mr. Jokic. Yes. Are you there? Yes. Do you have questions for Dr. Ranarajan? Are you familiar with Matt? Here's a question. Are you familiar with Madame Madeline McCann, the missing girl from Portugal? Can yes, you I do know about the McCann case. You know the McCann case? You've heard of it? I have heard of it, but I do not want to discuss that case here today, but I, but I am aware of that case. I want to ask a question. Are you a member of any secret society, the Thuggies from India, and Dr. Wong? Are you a member of any secret society like the Triads, Dr. Lazar, no, Mishpuka? No, no. And I don't want to say anything else more, but I'm not. So help you God on the Bible? Do you guys swear in the Bible anymore, or...? Do you believe uh, in the Bible, Dr. Lazar? I mean, Dr. Mr. Jukic, Mr. Jukic, could you please uh, direct your questions to Dr. Natarajan about what he just told us? It's all hearsay, conjecture, and half truths and lies mixed mixed together. Devil's advocate kind of bullshit. Sorry about the cursing. So, am uh, I? Was I lying, Doctor? Doctor, was I lying about Doctor Jose Delgado with the bull? Bulldog. You said bulldog. Trying.